Well, you're seeing everybody else play this, so well, why the hell not me? That's they right. Like it's time to play something that's really popular now. It's Cuphead. And what's best is, I can get copyright strikes on this. But... But, this music's distracting. Anyway, if I get a strike, I can go to the owners of the music and make a claim. They put a claim on the music because people are using the music on non-cuphead things, which is stealing. So, while I'm playing this game, if I get any copyright claims, I can go to a certain website, hit a certain email address, and the claim will be removed. Similar to how the uh, Kevin McCloud stuff works, although I never got hit by anything. I went and set everything up initially. The mouse does not do anything. Audio, I haven't really gone there. I'll just knock the volume down slightly. Yeah, you know what? I might just let it live. I've had this problem before. Worst case scenario, I put these videos on Facebook and just link you to them. Kinda sucks, but that's how it kinda has to work sometimes. So here we go, we're gonna play a new game. We're gonna try to keep these at about 30 minutes or so. This one might be a little longer. For those of you who don't want to see this stuff, there should be an annotation to where the game will actually start. For the rest of you, here we go. Once upon a time in a magical place called Inkwell Isle, there were two brothers named Cuphead and Mugman. They lived without a care under the watchful eye of the wise elder Kettle. One day the two boys wandered far from home, and despite the other Kettle's many warnings, ended up on the wrong side of the tracks and entered the Devil's Casino. Ooh. Inside, Cuphead and Mugman soon found themselves on a winning streak at the craps table. Hot dog! Uh, by the way, in the 30s, I don't think they spell dog like that. Error number one. I'll point a few more errors along the way. They tried to make this a 1930s looking game, and uh, they failed in a few spots. But not bad otherwise. Hot dog! exclaimed King Dice, a casino sleazy manager. Those fellas can't lose. Nice run, boys, laughed the newcomer. The brothers gasped. It was a casino's evil. owner. I'm getting ahead of myself. The devil himself. Now, how. About we raise the stakes, he suggested with a toothy grin. Win one more roll, and all the loot in my casino is yours. The devil boomed. But if you lose, I will have your souls. Deal? Cuphead, blinded by easy riches, nod and grab the dice for a throw. Good gosh, Cuphead, no! Cried Mugman, for he understood the danger, but it was too late. Probably too late to avoid copyright at this point. Snake eyes, laughed the devil while slamming the floor. You lose. The brothers tremble in fear as he looms over them. Now, about those souls. The brothers pleaded for their very lives. Th there must be another way to repay you, Mugman stammered. Yes, but please, Mr. Cuphead added. Being that I usually stutter when I start talking too fast, that kind of was natural. Hmm, perhaps there is, the devil snickered, pulling out a parchment. By the way, if it sounds like I'm yelling, it, it might be loud in my headphones, and it might not be loud on the video. I have here a list of my runaway debtors. Collect their souls for me, and I just might pardon you two mugs. Now get going, the devil roared, kicking the boys out most rudely. You have till midnight tomorrow to collect every one of those souls, otherwise I'll be the one collecting yours. Cuphead and Mugman were terribly frightened and ran away as fast as they could. Come on, Mug, panda Cuphead. We have to find the Elder Kettle. He'll know what to do. And thus starts the game, sort of.
Oh yeah. I'm... While we're waiting, there's a couple of things that are errors. One, the game is in widescreen, and in 1930s, widescreen was no such thing. Also, the game runs at 60 frames per second, which is very wrong looking, so I have Frap set up to record at the actual frame of film, frame rate of film, and that's 24. One thing they did get right is I believe they were going for the three film strip color, uh, color combination thing, because you can see that the colors look unaligned, misaligned. Because back in 1930, that's how they did color, with a two film strip uh, color combo, which didn't look good, and three color. Like I said, hence the color separation there. So, yes, it's not a perfectly smooth looking thing. It's meant to bring it to the... bring it to what it would probably look like in the 30s, more or less. Also, I am going to upload this at 720p because the film back then wasn't as clear as it is now, and 720p works. So I'm trying to make it a little more authentic than what the game actually provides. And now, the game. Explaining the errors. The tea kettle saith, What a fine pickle you boys have gotten yourself into. I know you don't want to be pawns of the devil, but if you refuse, I can't bear to imagine your fates. You must now play along for now, collect those contracts, and if you best be ready for some nasty business. Your debtor friends won't be very friendly once you confront them. In fact, I expect they'll transform into terrible beasts. Take this potion so they won't hang you out to dry. It'll give you the most remarkable magical abilities. Now go to my writing desk and use the mystical inkwell there. You need to prepare yourself for a scrap. That they did say in the 30s. Tutorial, as I definitely will need that. Now this is where you're gonna see that I've made the video more realistic looking towards the 30s and only doing 24 frames per second. While Fraps is hanging in at 48, sometimes up or down. Duck, hold down to crouch, and there you go. Space to jump. Oh. Mario physics. Space to jump. Dash, I did not set my dash key. Somehow I don't know how dash works. Oh, looks like we're gonna have our first pause. Let's look here. Something ain't right here. Oh. Wait, let me look at something else here. Okay, we are going to assign this. There. That might be why we can't dash. Now we got it. Hey, there we go. Descend down in space. Oh, this is going to be fun. Shoot. Oh, yeah. Shift for wrap. Now, if I want to aim, I hit C to lock my position, and then I can kind of... Well, it's a keyboard. You only have two ways to go here. You can't use the mouse at all. Okay, so uh, it is possible. I'm gonna hit 
the damn thing. Oh, I get it. I hold both up and right to aim diagonally or up and down to aim. Okay. Alright, that makes sense. Man, I'm gonna suck already. Parry slap. Press jump while airborne. Jump while airborne, okay. Uh, okay. This is going well. There we go. Uh, kinda. <laughs> yeah. I already forgot what dash is. if I were playing with some other people. Okay, that's what Z is. Coin. Collect those. Yeah, this, this is going to go very well, isn't it? Off we go. <laughs> Off to fail miserably and screw up the controls. You have to lay out those debtors to move on. Lemonade. Now shake a leg. So it's easy action key. Yeah, I'm gonna really screw up royally. This is gonna really be a watch me suck kind of deal. Wow, my computer takes forever to load these things. And the reason I'm doing this is there's hidden areas that you can go around. So I'm trying to find everything if I can. Okay, we can't go that way. I mean, I've seen some footage of people playing this game, so I got some idea. go that way. Yeah, let's just talk to this guy, as we can. Hey fellas, notice how it's set up for more of a two-player game. Because there's only one of us, and that's going to happen throughout the whole thing. Looks like you're in for now, eh? Can you tell this is a Canadian game? Oh, it used to be the same way, always getting into trouble. Running, jumping, shooting. But now I prefer just strolling around and going to the pictures. But hey, let me give you a hand. Take this. You received three gold coins. Good. Because I think we might be needing that. And one of the first things I'm definitely going to go into is the shop. So, long range of below average damage, heart extra hit point, adds an additional hit point, but I'm not going to do that. Spread 8-way, short range, inject great damage if you can keep close to your target. Smoke bomb, you will not take damage during your dash, great defense maneuver. Roundabout, great coverage with average damage, aim backward for maximum. I don't have anything good here. You gotta be impressed with this. I mean, they actually 
the backgrounds are actually drawn and watercolored. The sprites are hand drawn, but they did cheat by using the computer to fill in the colors because they found out that by hand painting and coloring with the computer, it literally looks absolutely no different. So that kind of concession we can, we can deal with. And we can't go down. We have to go with our first battle here. Let's see how bad this goes. We will try it regular. Five months later, we should be ready. Good day for a 12 battle. And begin! Which, all right, I'm already forgetting which ones to press. Oh, here we go. And... Doing good so far! Well, you know, see, I gotta get used to the controls now. I could parry that, but I'm not gonna. And I jumped to me. Alright, we got one. Put this crybaby out of misery here. Anything pink we can parry slap, but alright, we got that guy. And so far, not so bad. Uh, but that wasn't too good. And that was even worse. Oh, I almost got there. Yeah, this game is hard, and I'm... I mean, this is literally my first hey, ever go of it. So. Now go. And I'm already forgetting about this. We'll keep going. Now through quick jumps. Oh, that didn't work. A great slam and then some. Now, yeah, I can't set this up the way I truly want. It's totally keyboard, and on a laptop, it's kind of hard. Oh well, we'll take one. Well, let's put this guy away. He wasn't too bad. Ah, then I did that. Oh, I tried to move out at the last minute, and that didn't work. Good day for a well battle. And begin. Let's try this again. I suck so bad. <laughs> All right, that worked too. Now it's dispatch of the onion. Alright, we're doing much better. Now to get rid of the carrot. And apparently the onion's still crying, even though he isn't there anymore. Oh, damn. Come on, go down. Oh, so close. Yeah, these controls are kind of wonky. Here we go again.
probably like any other game, I'm gonna have to go back and refer to the, uh, refer to the, uh, control screen there and see what each one is. I set them up and then I forget what they are. I thought I got out of that tears way, but nope. better this time. Oh, damn it. Come on, go down. Oh. Oh. What an insult. A great slam and then some. And begin. Oh, they forget to hit the jump button. But unlike some other people, I'm not going to hit the retry button. We'll use this as experience. Yeah, we can't continue until we get past this whole thing. That doesn't take out the carrots. Good day for a swell battle. Here goes. Let's see if we can do it this time. He's came so close. I have to be honest, I think most of the people that get through this on the first try have played the game several times already. Okay, I didn't know that would happen. That didn't happen before. Again, more experience. Yeah, look, like it matters. Here's a real high class belt. And begin. Yeah, this is turning out very well. One thing I didn't notice is you do get a little bit of invincibility. Just a little. <laughs> this game is hard. Now in the bottom left. Damn it. Wasn't paying attention. And then I forgot where I was. I literally okay. lost where I was. Yeah, so I guess the first half hour of this game is just trying to get past the first guys. Well, here's another throw away. You never know. Alright, let's try to be a little more cautious this time. A little more conservative. I ran out of uh, some of the magic I had. A great slam and then some. Now go. Yeah, this is going very well. There we go. Hey, we got that much. 
This guy's usually easy. Sometimes he throws a couple of tears that screw me up. this time. Well, come on, kill him, kill him, kill him. He should be dead. Oh, I must have been ridiculously close. Well, not as close as before. A brawl is surely brewing. Yeah. Of course, any pink object, as I said before, you can parry, which actually will give you more cards. As you can see, there's, there's cards uh, next to my health points. When I get five, I can uh, release a superpower, but I don't have any of those yet. I forgot. You kind of have to earn those. But when I have at least a full card, I can deal a heavier dose of damage. Take this more cautiously now. Oh, I trapped myself. Here's a real high class bout. It's on. Wait a minute, I can get by this. And the onion's not too bad either. Through a fourth one and a third. Oh, I guess this is all you're going to see for the half hour. Because I'm not willing to play the baby level quite yet. Once again, the cry. Yeah, whatever. This match will get red hot. Here goes. Let's try this another 500th time. I think we're up to 501. All right, we, we got to get back here now. By this guy. It's the carrot that becomes the problem. Like I said, outside of the aspect ratio and outside of the aspect ratio and the fact that the video doesn't rock a little bit. aiming up. That's kind of a problem. Come on. Kill him. Damn it. I got plenty of... I still got two more. Oh, 
how close was I this? Oh, that's even worse! I mean, I was right there! A great slam and then thunder. You're up! See, what got me there is I then forgot which key was fire. Old people trying to play Cuphead. You saw how funny it was on uh, Elders React to Cuphead, if you've seen that video. I mean, I get another 15, 20 years of youth on my side, but still. Now comes that GD Karen. Keep it the wrong buttons. Oh, I jumped into that. That was stupid. Oh, and I, I thought he was done. Why aren't we firing? I had the button down. I had the button down. Why did it stop firing? You're up. Still save it. And now the damn carrot. Ooh, I almost walked into the end there. It's gotta be close. Hey! Finally! Wonder how low of a grade I'm gonna get. Pretty pathetic. Well, mid 17. Two of the three, no parries, a six. The skill level, well, that's the one I play at. A brand new record, because it's never been played. Well, that's probably the only level we'll get by today. And you get to hear my neighbor's dogs bark because they're pain they're a pain in the butt. We got the root pack soul contract. It sucks doing the work of the devil. But kinda locked into that. Let's see this guy's <laughs> I'll be a monkey's uncle if I'm putting my moolah in the bank. For all I know, the devil probably controls that place too. They'll never get a hold of my gold if I spread it all around. And if some Joe happens to find a coin or two, good for him. That's what I have to say. Humph. So that means, because like I said, I've seen people play this game. If you go around and search randomly, you might find some stuff. Secret areas, might see some coins that he's alluded to. This is Clip Joint Calamity. Well, might as well get another fight in here. See how this one goes. Probably not very well. A great slam and then stop. Here goes. Oh, forgot to duck. Hammer. Yeah, this is going. Yep, that one will. Of course, I forget if I hit the C key, I can lock myself and then use the arrow keys to shoot at things. But here's a real high class battle. It's on. Okay, that part 
that's kind of easy. Watch me blow it. trying to blow me into him. Funny thing is in the videos it almost looks like they're trying to take me the opposite direction. Oh, I almost took a direct hit there. Alright, this is where parrying helps. If I... Things like that don't happen. Well, I think that will be it for now. How craptacular that was, right? So, yeah, that'll be it for Cuphead. We'll come back and do it a little more every half hour or so. Went a little longer because I felt like it was okay. First time. George 551 saying hope you enjoyed and have a good one.